guys in this video we're gonna see how to customize the bootstrap for navbar so let's go and create a new project call it navbar i'm gonna open this bracket project i'm gonna create two files the first one is the index.html second one is style sheet style.css I will go to the bootstrap website click on the get started I'm gonna scroll down and find the starter template copy I will go back to my text editor the first thing I will do is to link my style sheet to this file and then I'm gonna run this file now the thing I want to show you guys is this let's put an ID here and say h1 now if I go to the my style that says s and say that h1 has a color red if I add if I say h1 so I selected my my ID and if I say color blue obviously it will turn to blue but if I say if I add here important rule it stays red so why am I going through this I want to let you guys know that the bootstrap people wrote their code with a lot of important rules so sometimes if you do a change with your CSS and it doesn't work it means you have to add this rule now I will go to the campaigns and scroll down to the navbar and I will copy the navbar code I'll get back to my text editor remove this line and add the navbar code now here is my navbar I want now to customize it so my navbar as a class navbar you could choose any one of this but I will choose navbar and go to my style that says as file I'm going to select uh, the navbar class and then it will say the background color is black but it didn't change so I have to add the important rule now we have to change the navbar brand color I will go and say navbar then navbar brand and now I will change the color to white now if I hover it disappears the solution is to add a hover now if I hover it doesn't change then then I will change the length color so we'll say navbar 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 nav the list item and the anchor see color and add the important now if I click on the drop down menu you can see that the length disappears so I have to change their colors say navbar and then nav item and then drop down menu and then 
drop down item I will change the color to black all I will either have a rule I'll set the background color to, to black and the opacity to 0 0.5 and then the color is white. It's cool. The last thing to do is so the last thing to do is then now butter blur. I will change the background color to white. And this is it. So thanks for watching the video and see you guys in another one. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.